What's up, my Sin City crew? I'm back again with another video for you guys. I'm sitting out here. I'm at my daughter's job. I'm waiting on her to come out. So I have like 20 minutes to talk to you guys. So in the meanwhile, let's get started. Okay. So what do y'all think about me getting a, a teacup poodle? I want me a teacup poodle, you guys. And I've been looking into it. I've been going on sites and everything looking for teacup poodles because I want one. So anyway, um, they're very expensive. Very expensive. $2,500 to $4,500. But it's just like with anything. If you want it bad enough, you'll save up for it or you'll make a sacrifice for it, right? So... I have decided to make a sacrifice and save up for me a teacup poodle because I'm lonely, y'all. I mean, my baby 18, she working, she gone. I'm at the house. Walt is pretty much, you know, doing his thing around the house, playing a game, watching TV in the living room or whatever. I be in the room by myself and I'm maybe probably on the computer or doing something like that. But I want me a puppy. So what y'all think about that? Do y'all think it's too much? Or should I just go for it? I need you, you guys' opinion. I know y'all gonna tell me what's up. But uh, yeah, so that's what I've been looking into for the past couple of days. I have been saying I wanted a teacup poodle, but I hadn't, you know, just really just, really just been looking. But now I'm looking. I'm kind of serious about it. They are very, very little cute little puppies. I want the tiny teacup poodle. So. I was looking at one. It's like the one I want is probably twenty-five to three thousand. So I said I wanted to try to give me one. Not right now. Not no time. So I gotta save up, y'all. You know, and get it. But I mean, it's just. I mean, I want it. If I want some, I want it. You know, you get what you want. So anyway, that's what I want. So how you guys been doing? Tomorrow is Mother's Day. As you know, as we know, tomorrow is Mother's Day, and my daughter's coming over today. We're going to do, do a seafood boil, and we're going to video it, and that's something for you guys. I want you guys to tune in and watch. We're doing a seafood boil, so I want you guys to be there to watch me eat my seafood boil. That's if you want to. But anyway, you guys, y'all hear how I'm breathing? It's kind of hard breathing in this mask, but I have to have it on for when she get ready to come out that, that building because, you know, I don't trust it. I just don't trust her working at a warehouse and then, you know, come and get in the car and stuff. I'm just trying to be safe. Y'all see I got my hand sanitizer. Got my hand sanitizer. I got my antibacterial hand wipes. I got some more hand sanitizer. I'm not playing. I mean what I say. I'm serious about this stuff. You know, and I got I got a thicker mask. The mask that I had on the other day, everybody was saying it was kind of thin, but I know they were thin. I, I usually put paper towels in it to thicken it up. <clears throat> but since I was at my daughter's house, you know, I just, I didn't even think about putting on in there. We, I was good over there. I hope anyway. I don't think that, uh, you know, she ain't been around nobody. I ain't been around nobody. So, just doing what I have to do. That's all. But anyway, you guys, I came just to talk to you guys for a little while. You know, because uh, I had to take the other video down because it was music all in the background and all that kind of stuff. So, I just took it down before they said anything, you know. Um, and so, I decided to come and do another video with you guys today. So, what you guys been up to? Put in the comments. Let me know what y'all been up to and what y'all gonna do for Mother's Day tomorrow. That'll be something good for me to sit and read <clears throat> and occupy my mind and my time for a minute. You know, I, I enjoy reading you, you guys' comments. You know, so, yes. Please, comment and let me know what y'all doing for Mother's Day. Um, I know a lot of people, you know, don't have a mother. Unfortunately, and I'm happy to say that I do. I have still have my mother among me, um, and my kids uh, have me among them. So, uh, for those who don't have a mother, 
um, my condolence, you know, and I give you all the love and support. Uh, you know, I got you guys. A lot of um, my subscribers has already um, come in and let me know, you know, they, they lost their parent or whatever. And, you know, my heart goes out to each and every one of you guys, um, if that's the case. But anyway, happy Mother's Day, early Mother's Day to all the mothers out here in the world, on the YouTube world and all the surrounding world. It doesn't matter. Just happy Mother's Day to anybody who have kids and to myself. <clears throat> and yes, um, so anyway, my kids gave me my Mother's Day gift the other day when I was over to my daughter's house. So I do have my um, my Mother's Day gift. They gave me money, but I went and bought what I wanted to buy. So, you know, that was that was my choice, what I wanted. Walt's supposed to be getting my Mother's Day gift. So I'm going to see what he got for me. Um, and I mean, hey, that's, it is what it is, you know. And I'm going to get my mom something as well. I got to get my mom something. Um, I don't know if she uh, will accept it or whatever because... You know, her religion and all that kind of stuff. But anyway, I'm going to try to give her some. I'll give her some money or something like that. <clears throat> but yes, you guys, I'm here at my daughter's job, chilling, talking to my folks, my people, my supporters, my Sin City crew. Yes, I'm doing that. I'm most definitely sitting out here waiting on my daughter, watching the people go by. And with all uh, masks on and all that kind of stuff. I thought they supposed to have masks on up in this jump, But I don't see any. They probably took it out. Oh, okay. He got it down. I'm sorry. He got it on. He just got it pulled down like this. So it's all good. I just got mad because I don't want to be breathing this stuff in. Even though I'm in the car. So, you know. I like my mask, y'all. It's a fashion statement. And guess what? This is what I'm going to do. Until this stuff over. And I don't even believe it's going to be over. So guess what? This might be something that we have to do at all times. I, I see a lot of stores that you go in. No mask, no service. You can't even enter if you don't have a mask on. So that means you're going to have to have a mask on at all times. So you know how that go. But yeah, um, I was just coming to you guys because I hadn't talked to you in a couple of days since I was over my daughter's house. And, you know, I have to come with something for you guys. Talk to you or say something because I'm always thinking about you. And I'm always reading your comments and I'm talking to you in the comments as well. But I feel comfortable about coming to you on a video and just, you know, just touching bases with all you guys. Um, so, like I say, uh, I'm thinking about giving me a poodle. A teacup poodle. They very expensive, y'all. And why would I? You know what you want a dog that expensive? Because I want one. That's a down payment on me. A car. So, okay, well, you get your down pay. You pay the down payment on your car, and I'm going to get me a puppy. You know, I want a puppy. You know, I need me a little baby. I can put in the bed with me and rock and hold and talk to and play with when I ain't got nobody else around me, you know? So yeah, I want I want me a teacup poodle, y'all. They they I I looked them up, so they are from twenty five to forty five hundred. The t the tiny teacup poodles are uh right at three thousand dollars. I ain't got to get the most expensive one, you know. I ain't got to get the most expensive one, but I do want one, and I want a pretty one. I don't know if I want a girl or a boy. I want I think I want a girl. That way, if I, well, you know what? I don't even know if they have babies. They so little. They only five pounds, y'all. I think the the biggest that uh, somebody said they get to the, where the tiny uh, teacup poodles are five pounds. And then, uh, this seems like it's something. It's on length or something. Yeah, it is. It's length. Um, the, 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 the tiny uh, poodles are... They don't get no uh, bigger than five pounds. And then I think the next tour, and they like uh, uh, 15, I mean, 2,000 to 2,500, they get seven pounds. So, yeah. But I, I really want one. I think that uh, that'll really, you know, give me some company to play with, give him little baths and buy him toys. I want to go get him a little, um, 
uh, 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 the little cage to put him in and the little thing he could sleep in. You know, I want to do all that. I just, I need to, you know, do something. I just sit at home. I be bored, y'all. And a puppy will do me good right now. You know, that's something that I want. So I want to try to, you know, get me one. Even though it's going to be expensive, so. I just hope don't nobody steal it from me. That's the only thing. But I'm going to take them everywhere. I'm going to take her everywhere I go. So, they ain't going to be able to steal it from me. Because I'm going to watch it like a hawk. You know me. I'm going to be on my baby. But, yeah. So, what y'all think about that? Should I give me a puppy or not? Or should I do something else with that money? It depends, huh? I know y'all going, what? You just want a puppy for? I want me a puppy. Just like why would say, why would you spend all that money? Because I want one. If I want to uh, if I want to save up and give me a puppy, I want one. You know, I think it'll be something good. And then as they get older, they don't get no bigger. I'm scared of big dogs, so I have to give me a small dog, y'all. You know what I'm saying? Yes, yes. I ain't did nothing to my hair, y'all, since I got it done. I'm talking about as far as putting curlers on it and flat on it and all that kind of stuff. I ain't did nothing to it. I'm not going to do nothing to it. I'm just going to, I've been sleeping on it and wearing it. And that's all going to be did to it. I, I, I ain't got time for all that. You know, I don't have time for all that. I don't feel like curling. It's too hot. I be sweating like a pig uh, when I'm in the bathroom curling my hair and stuff. When I get out the bathtub, I be sweating. Then I try to curl my hair. I'm sweating. I'm getting hot. I got to put the fan on me. That's not good. So I said, mm-mm. I just leave it like this. I sleep on it. It's okay. It's good hair, so I can do that. Yep. But anyway. Oh, I get how many minutes to wait on this girl? I don't want to turn it on because the music might pop up. And uh, I have to delete this video as well. I don't want to do that. But do y'all, can y'all see? I don't know if y'all can see the parking lot. There's a lot of cars out over here. A lot of cars. It was so crowded this morning. My daughter told me, it ain't that many cars out here today. I said, yes, it is. It's more than I, when I used to come to work. It wasn't, it wasn't nobody barely here. Everybody here now, I guess because they're making it extra two, $2 more. I mean, you know, because Amazon pay real good. I ain't going to even lie. It pays good. So, and they, you know, you're going to get paid every two weeks. It's good money. And people in here, they making their money. And if I wasn't uh, already, you know, like I said, back in January, in December, end of December, first of January, I was sick. <clears throat> I had a bad, they said a bowel infection. I was coughing. I had uh chest pains and stuff like that only thing i didn't have i didn't have fever i didn't have no chills my throat wasn't sore and like that because i kept on drinking that hot tea and all that kind of stuff but i was sick the end of December first of january when i was working here so anyway um now i'm ha i have chest pains and stuff like that so i'm not trying to come back and be sick again you know what i'm saying so therefore i'm just gonna i'm trying to wait till all this stuff out. i might come back i don't know I might just come back, but it ain't going to be no time soon. It's going to be when it's over, this stuff over with, and I don't know how long that's going to be. So, you know how that go. But anyway, I miss Amazon. I miss my co-workers and all that kind of stuff. Everybody was cool with me. HR, I was cool with everybody. You know, I'm just a type, type person. I talk to everybody, and that's what I do. You know, I communicate with a lot of people and stuff. So, anyway, um, with that being said... Um, I miss my I miss my people. I miss my co-workers. You know, I like to kick it with people and talk to them, and they be missing me when I had missed a month once before. And when I came back, they were like, "I thought you had quit. I miss you. I miss you." That goes to show when you're a good person, people will miss you. So that's how I was. You know, I'm always giving and and giving my uh, opinion, good opinions. If I ain't got no good opinions or positive opinions to give people when they come to me with problems, I'm not gonna say anything. You know, I try to you know give them my uh, a positive, honest opinion because don't nobody want to hear no negativity. If, if I gotta say something negative, I don't even want to say none at all. So anyway, you guys. I'm going to get off of here. My daughter should be coming out soon. Please like, share, and 
hit that bell share 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 and please watch my ads you guys please watch the commercials and i'll talk to you and see you on the next video stay tuned to my seafood boil coming up tomorrow